I'm baking up some dreamy lemon sweet rolls. So I'm starting on the dough. I'm gonna take a tablespoon of sugar and use it for my yeast mixture. So I have here a small saucepan. I'm gonna add the sugar in here. I'm gonna add a cup of whole milk. I'm gonna add a stick of unsalted butter. I actually have a thermometer here because I need this milk to get to a certain temperature to activate the yeast, yes. All right, I wanna be somewhere between 105 and 115, 112, we're in business. And that's important because anything higher than 115, you're just gonna kill the yeast. So I have one packet of active dry yeast. This is gonna take about five to 10 minutes to bloom. While that's blooming and getting ready to activate our dough, I'm gonna get started on the dough. Now I'm gonna add two eggs and one teaspoon of salt. I'm gonna add four cups of flour to my stand mixer here. Let me check on that yeast. That foam means the yeast is being activated. So I'm gonna go over here and add it to my mixture with the eggs, the sugar, and the salt. All right, and so what I'm gonna do now is add this mixture into my stand mixer with the flour. I'm gonna beat it until a dough forms, and that's gonna take about 10 minutes or so. So this looks done. So I'm gonna spray this bowl with nonstick spray, plop that right in there. And what I need for this to do now is rise. I'm just gonna let it sit back here. I'm gonna cover it with a damp towel so it creates humidity. It makes for the perfect environment for this dough to rise. And while that's hanging out, I'm gonna make my filling and my frosting. All right, so I have three lemons here. I'm not gonna use this one right now. I'm gonna use that for the cream cheese icing that goes on top. So I'm gonna zest these two lemons. I'm gonna take the juice of one lemon, that's about two tablespoons, and put that right in there with three quarters cup of sugar. Mix it up. All right, so my filling is done. Now I'm gonna get started on the glaze. So I'm gonna use half of this cream cheese block, so that's four ounces, one stick of unsalted butter, room temp, because it all needs to come together. Now I'm gonna beat this until it becomes nice and fluffy and well incorporated. Just a few more seconds and this will be done. All right, cool. Now I'm gonna squeeze about a tablespoon of lemon juice in here. I'm infusing lemon flavor all throughout this sweet lemon roll. I'm gonna add a half a teaspoon of vanilla extract, one cup of sifted sugar, and the reason I'm sifting this powdered sugar is because I don't want any clumps inside this glaze. Now I'm gonna add in a quarter teaspoon of salt, kosher salt. Give it a mix again. I'm just gonna beat this until it comes together. And now I'm gonna add a tablespoon of poppy seeds. All right, so there's this bakery in North New Jersey that I used to go to a lot. It was in my neighborhood when I lived there. And they had this, this Danish that had cream cheese and like a dollop of lemon curd, and they would sprinkle poppy seeds in the middle. That's where I got the idea for this lemon sweet roll from. Look at this. Gorgeous, gorgeous. Dough has risen. Put a little bench flour on my cutting board. I like to stretch it and get to rolling. Now I'm gonna start on my filling. I'm gonna take about four tablespoons of unsalted butter, a little over room temp because you need it to spread just like this. And now I'm gonna take that lemon sugar zest mixture and put it on top. I'm using that same offset to spread the butter and the lemon and the sugar mixture. Now it's time to roll. I'm gonna go this way because I'm left-handed. So just a tight roll. I have a nine by 13 casserole dish here that I have greased and buttered. Now I wanna show you guys a trick. 
I like to use dental floss to cut my dough because it cuts dough cleaner than most knives. I like to go under, wrap it around my fingers, tie it and should snap right off. There you go. See, just like that. So I'm gonna cut about 15 rolls. I'm gonna put it into my casserole dish. I'm gonna let it proof for an additional hour. I'm gonna pop it in the oven and let it bake for about 25 minutes, ice it, and then serve it. What do we got over here? Mm-hmm, look, 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 ta-da! Oh, these look absolutely delicious. What are we yeah. doing here? Okay, so I need you to put the icing on top of our lemon sweet rolls. I would love to. Oh, this All right. looks so delicious. Ooh. Now, girl, you better slather that thing down. Oh, <laughs> look at you. Give it to us. Now you know you gotta save the best for last. The lemon zest, mm -hmm. oh, the warmth from the roll. This is delicious, Cardi. Mm. Absolutely.